You ready to fight? Ready. Good. All right, ready to go with round one, and so is Andre Arlovsky. You talk to his coaches, they believe the skills really haven't regressed. Shin figures to be tested here early, but you certainly have to be mindful of Arlovsky's power, one of the more prolific first-round finishers this UFC heavyweight division has ever seen. Oh, trying to turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. Great technique there. Double leg. And now is where things could get really interesting. Trying to pass the guard here, but a nice job by the bottom fighter defense. Bottom fighter did a fantastic job of following with his hips, making sure he blocked any attempt to get past his guard. Right hand over the top. Oh, and another one there by Arlovsky. Nice block. Tags him with the straight, beautifully placed there by Nogueira. He's so confident. That timing was on point. Nice takedown lane. All right, full guard here if you're the top fighter. What are you trying to do? I'm trying to pass to the next position. Get the half guard so I can get my grounded palm off. Arlovsky gets back up again. Nicely done. In the tie clinch. Look for the knees to start. Oh, and now the underhook knee suit. He's got the underhook. He's got the far side post. If you're the opponent, you have got to get out of here. Alright, so he just decides to get up here and let the opponent up. Just over three minutes to go in our first round. Oh, that one landed, yep. Oh, good block there. Takedown defense is there. The pit bull gets back up. He loaded up there with that high kick. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. And he's looking for that left hand, just missed. Noguera gets crushed with that hook. And again, he shoots for a takedown here. Nearly got the fight to the ground, but once again, the takedown defense holds up. But he knows this. He knows that in order to finally get the fight to the ground, he has to be patient and he's gonna have to be committed if he thought that he would get every takedown he shot he would not find the success that he intends to get just misses with the jab there oh big right he is getting lit up right now john oh that was a really nice takedown Under two minutes now to go in round one. Get up, get up, get up, get up. Noguera's looking to pass here, denied by the opponent. Oh, that's got to be discouraging as he gets right back up again. All right, so some definite damage underneath the elbow now on the side of his opponent. A lot of strikes to the body starting to start to add up. Yeah, a lot of strikes to the body and mixing up the attack. Not being one-dimensional, not headhunting inside the octagon. I, I think he is fought beautifully right now. He's starting to show itself. Take it for a ride. Nice double leg, nice finish. All right, trying to pass here, as Glover Teixeira might say, not today. Not today. Great job of following with the hips, keeping those legs locked and keeping them in full guard. All right, 45 seconds now to go on the round. Oh, he passes the half guard now. And he's not posturing the lamp punches, so look for a submission attempt. Well, the ground and pound has been on point tonight. Good work here by Noguera. And he's back up again. So the takedowns have been there, as have the get-ups. Look at that switch lead. Beautiful switch lead. Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. First round winding down here. Get that 
Oh. And swell on it between rounds if we get there. Five minutes in the books. All right. Take a deep breath. Relaxa. Respira. Okay, that was perfect. Great control on the ground. But I need you to be more active on this. All right, so let us now check out some of the action in that round, DC. There was a whole lot of it, including a stunner upstairs that nearly closed the show. It was a lot of action. It was back and forth action. But the big moment was that big strike to the head that landed that put him on wobbly legs and in survival mode. Luckily, he made it to the end of that round. You ready? You ready? Go. All right, round two. Well Combination. Well, his opponent seemed to be stunned to a significant extent, but was able to recover, and it's almost like he let him off the hook a little bit. Kind of let him off the hook. He needed to really put his foot on the gas to try to find that pin. The pit bull getting peppered here from the top. He's got to figure out a way to cover up. Oh, trying to pass here, but Dikembe Mutombo style, Blocked. he gets denied. Blocked! Great job blocking that pass by the bottom fighter. Come on, on your feet now. attempting to pass here, but he's denied by the defense. All right, the referee not seeing enough action there. We go back to the center of the octagon now. They're so evenly matched, and they're going to the cat. All right, so look at that. A cut has been... Oh! Oh, look at that. Now he's taunting after landing that huge strike. Him. He landed his punch, and he just showboated a little bit. I don't have a problem with it. <laughs> Big power shot there. Stuffs the takedown. No problem. That hook was bad. Oh, big left hook there. Trying to do damage now with the kick. That's a miss. Keep your head in it. Keep your head in it. Just over three minutes to go in round two. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is his takedown defense? So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Well, I'm not sure if there's a facial fracture of some kind, but the striking approach has certainly worked tonight. And his opponent... All right, breaking the action here. No surprise to see the referee call for the doctor to look at that eye, which is essentially swollen shut at this point. Yeah, it's swollen shut. I mean, the end swell is not working. Sometimes the swelling is too much, and you have to save the fighter from themselves. And it looks as though he is going to allow the fighter to continue. So a nice pop from the crowd as that decision is made. He's got to go for it now, though. You ready to fight? You ready? Go. All right, so the ref will get the action back underway after that brief health and safety check. And to no one's surprise, the fans support the decision for the action to continue. Absolutely. I mean, this... Oh! tonight absolutely gets it with style points a huge huge result here in this arena tonight it's always fun to see an athlete tell you what they're going to do and then they do it this guy told us he was going to get a finish and that's exactly what he did him and his team are going to have a fantastic time tonight celebrating they should all be very proud All right, the official decision is in. It resides with Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 43 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by TKO, Andre the Pitbull Olowski.